Welcome back to another deck design video where I make custom cool skateboards that are similar to the ones right here behind me. Recently I made that Inuyasha board. Today we're going to be making a board from Fire Force or a character from Fire Force. I've already finished it. The board looks fantastic. I have been really behind schedule because I've been kind of lazy and work has been kind of crazy. So pardon the lack of content, but that is the board that we are going to be making in today's video. So stay tuned to see how I did everything and just see the final results because it looks really, really good. All right, so first things first, it's time to basically create the outline of the design. And what I'm using is a projector. It works the best out of anything that I've ever used. So I will continue to use it until I figure out some other method, but uh, do the outline. And then once I finish, I'm gonna go and do all of the main colors first or the big areas that have a lot of colors, which is mainly black and tan. So I'm gonna do the black first, go through her entire outfit, and then I'll do the, uh, the white for her body. This is only the first layer, so you're probably gonna see a lot of streaks throughout. The black tends to hide everything, but any other light color, you'll just see all of the streaks. So ignore that for right now. We will come back later and fix all of that. Once I finish with her skin, I'm gonna go back through and do the flames for her tails and her ears. And again, this is just the first layer. It's not anything crazy. I just want to get all the main colors down first. Then we'll go back through and do all the fine details. face I went ahead and started on the hair and her hair color is a little bit of a bluish black color and I didn't really know how to go about doing that besides just doing a base coat of blue with the marker and then covering that with black it kind of blended together and kind of shaded everything how exactly I wanted it to look so I actually think it worked out perfectly and it was looking a little flat so I went in and did little squigglies for like hair strands and I think that worked out perfectly now we're onto the second layer of her skin and we're basically doing about three layers total. So I just went through, did a layer and then waited for dry, did another, another layer. And then we're gonna start working on the shading part using a brown color, which honestly the shading made this whole board pop and it looks so much better this way. It was looking good already, but the shading, I mean, it just makes the whole board stand out even more. And then we went and started her clothes and made them a little bit on the shaded spectrum as well. We just, there, there's a lot of shading involved on this whole entire board, uh, just using multiple colors of everything that I had. Gray, black, tan, white, just trying to get as close to the reference picture as possible. Uh, once I finished all that, I got my fine point marker, I guess if that, that's what it's called, I don't really know. And I went through and kind of outlined everything to create even more detail that I didn't create with the, the blending and the shading. struggle with the hands a lot but this board actually worked out much better than I expected and same thing for the face and the eyes usually I'm pretty terrible at it but everything was just working out and I'm very happy with the way that it turned out uh, shading for the eyes was a little bit on the more difficult side I still made it work and I think that it matches exactly like the reference picture but I don't know you tell me
is the finished result and it looks so damn good. So happy with the way it turned out. This is actually a Tom Key from Fire Force. So if you haven't watched Fire Force and you want to know where this character came from, definitely go check it out. It is definitely not inappropriate. I know this is kind of like raunchy and slightly inappropriate. Sorry to the young viewers, but uh, I want to try to use it for, you know, clickbaity content, I guess. Regardless, though, it looks really, really good. And Fire Force, the anime itself, is really good, too. So definitely go check it out so you can get an idea of who the character is. But uh, let me know which anime character I should do next. I'm thinking about doing a One Punch Man design. I actually have a reference picture that I'll pop up with. But, I mean, this one turned out really good. My Inuyasha board turned out really, really good. And so did the Aaron Attack on Titan and the Luffy One Piece. I could do another wood burn like that. It just takes a very long time. Granted, all these take a long time. But this just, it creates a lot of, like, a burning smell everywhere and it lasts for weeks so let me know if I should do wood burn if I should do another paint thing like this or do another one similar to this one here I can definitely tell the quality of my artwork has gotten much much better over the years I mean compared to like these over here which honestly those two are really good this is the first one I ever did for grip and it was definitely derpy but that's second I mean honestly you can't really tell how much I've progressed but I can see it I think it looks really good and I'm happy with it. That is going to be it for today's video, so thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the content. I do apologize that the content has been, you know, a little behind schedule right now. I'm trying to get back onto schedule or even create one in general. I've just been really lazy trying to figure out a way to change the YouTube channel in general because YouTube doesn't like my content. It hasn't for a while and I need to figure out a better system on what I need to do. So hopefully I can figure that out and come up with a game plan. I do plan on doing a giveaway for Christmas, something along the lines of giving away a bunch of my custom design decks because I need to make a lot more room. As you can tell, I've got all those there and more on my computer desk and my office is filthy and a mess and I just need to make more room. So potentially thinking of doing a really big giveaway for Christmas, Hopefully the next few days I can figure out the exact game plan and which boards I'm gonna give away. I might leave a poll on Instagram on which ones I should do. So keep a lookout for that. I don't know. But again, that's it. So thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Later.